Hi guys, I hope you are all doing fine. Um, I have today an unboxing for you and this is a bag I'm looking for since two, two, three months. It was, it's an XCM bag and I believe it was on sale last um, fall winter and I missed out buying it then. But then it did not get out of my head and I started looking for it. And I saw it on Nordstrom. And I, um, although I wanted this backpack in a uh, cognac color, I ordered it in black because that was the only one available and I really wanted to see this backpack. So it came and it was in very bad condition. The leather had scratches, the um, straps were missing, and it had a very bad smoke smell, nicotine smell, and it was bad and I sent it back. So my search started again and then I found it one day on Neiman Marcus and ordered it. And now of course I'm afraid, excited to see in what condition the bag comes here. And um, yeah, let's open it up together and see. And um, this time I got it in cognac color, which was also the color I really wanted this backpack in. I know too many backpacks, but I just love it. And it's a convertible backpack again. It's not the MCM Mini, it's the MCM Essential Vesetos backpack. It's a little bigger. And you will see, let's open it together. And let's have the fingers crossed that um, it comes in good condition. And um, yeah, I usually don't like to pay full price. But because I wanted this backpack so much and it was sold out everywhere, I um, paid full price for this bag. So let's see what we are dealing with this time. The protective wrapping is not on here. Not sure. Let me see. There is no proper stuffing in here. It's definitely a return. I don't know. It has the a warranty card inside. It has the guitar strap inside. But it smells like really chemical and kind of used also. Um, I'm not sure. It has the protective steps here. Yeah, it has still the protective steps around this closure. It smells new actually. It smells very new. Um, but it definitely doesn't have the protective um, uh, wrappings and all those things. I will inspect this bag closely and see. And then, um, I don't know, I don't know if I want to pay full price for this backpack. Um, I will inspect this bag properly and I will come in back to you guys the next few days um, to share what I decided and yeah, everything. Bye bye. Hi guys, I hope you are all doing fine. Um, I yesterday shared an unboxing with you of this bag. And I mentioned at the end that I will inspect it thoroughly and then think about whether I should keep it or not. 
and like I said yesterday I was looking at this bag for two months I mean I was trying to find this bag for two months and I ordered it once from Nordstrom in black because it was nowhere to be found in Cognac and um, they sent it to me and it was full of scratches I will insert pictures at the beginning or the end of the video and um, then I found I returned it I found this at Neiman Marcus and ordered it so it came yesterday it didn't have any of the protective uh, plastic wraps around the straps or the um, hardware or um, it was not even stuffed properly and it definitely is a return and i think it was used because upon further inspection i saw that um, the leather has a slight wrinkling. On this side, it's fine. You don't see much. But this side, you see quite some wrinkling here. So that was one thing. The second thing is that the um, straps are in medium condition. They have been used for sure. And I paid full price for this bag. So I'm really indecisive whether to keep it or not. I'm still thinking about it, but I thought I will show you what fits in it and how it looks on me, do some mod shots and then decide because I also have um, the star side studs backpack and they are quite similar. I mean, they are quite similar. They're both convertible backpacks, but um, yeah, this one has a guitar strap, which was also not in uh, any wrapping, so it didn't come new. And I really think for full price, you should get a new backpack. Um, this was, by the way, $825. This was $750. And um, yeah, I didn't start using this because I'm using the Berlin gold colored one right now, mostly. So um, yeah. I still will have to think about it, but um, let's get into the video. So this backpack has a case lock closure and it doesn't have a zipper. It looks very casual and style. So um, I'm taking the stuffing out with me because there is not much stuffing, you will be fine in no time. So this is how the backpack looks from inside. It has just this little pocket here in the back. Otherwise, you are free to put in your things like you want. Um, the, for example, the BB boot does not fit a full-size uh, wallet. This one does. It does fit my full-size MCM wallet. Then I put in my um, sunglasses, my catch oil. And my keys. So that's how it looks now, and that's my essentials to carry. And this backpack's name is MCM Bizetto's Essential Backpack. So you're supposed to carry your essentials in it and not um, consider this for when you have a lot to carry around for those I, the days I have my bigger backpacks. So now I'll show you quickly how it looks on me. Again, I'm 5'5". Five five. I mention this in every video because um, not everyone watches every video that I post. So this is how it looks. It looks really cute. I think my heart will bleed when I send it back because I yesterday checked it's really nowhere available right now. So this is how it looks. And to be honest, I like the straps. I mean, the quality of the straps is not new, but I like the sizing of the straps better than of the BB Boo. The BB Boo straps are very, very long, show you, and you cannot adjust them to a smaller size. So the BB Boo 
case down like this it hangs much more and this is the smallest setting you can make it unless you put an extra hole inside of the straps so this is the thing you do so yes this was my quick video and if you have an opinion whether to keep it or not keep it what you think should I pay full price for this backpack, although it didn't come in absolutely new condition? Um, or return it? It's definitely better than a Nord Strings once. I, you will see it on the pictures. And I really like this backpack. So that's it. I wish you all a good day and stay safe, stay healthy and see you on my next one. Bye bye.